warm your heart is sharing your heart with a hero. And the folks at McKee Bakery have teamed up with News 12 Now. WFLI Radio is well on board, and Evan Stone is here. And Evan has kind of spearheaded this whole thing for several years. Evan, first of all, congratulations on a great job. You got 4,500 plus little Debbies here. Why? Well, as you said, we've been doing this now for uh, several years with News 12, but Hearts for Our Heroes is a gesture to be able to uh, just tell them how much we appreciate them. Fire, police, EMS, paramedics, 911 dispatchers. This year we're adding doctors and nurses because they have really been the true heroes uh, in the fight of this pandemic. So uh, we're, we're just excited to be able to do that. We're going to be, uh, we got a lot of the uh, folks here from the law enforcement and the EMS and fire. And they're going to be uh, taking these back to all the, uh, the great men and women that uh, work for us 24 hours a day. And then you're going to load these up and take them to the area hospitals, correct? We are, we are going to deliver because to the doctors and nurses at the three uh, major hospitals here in the uh, Chattanooga region uh, after we get finished here this afternoon. Job well done. Absolutely. Job well done. Thank you, and thank uh, News 12 and, uh, and uh, Mountain View Chrysler, Dodge Jeep Ram Absolutely. here, LeBron Clark, along with the Accident Recovery Firm, and McKee Bakery. Oh, yeah. Boy, they come through this year. We're going to talk to those folks here in a minute. And congratulations to you and me. It's the first time we've ever done a live shot with a mask hanging from our ear. Thanks. Anyway, you got to do what you got to do. Mask up. Come on out and join us in Mountain View, Chrysler, Dodge, Jeep, Ram, just off Alabama Highway in Ringgold, if you are so inclined. We're going to talk with the folks from McKee Bakery and some of the actual first responders who will get some of these delicious treats coming up in just a few minutes. Okay? And what you were seeing here the reason why we are all here at Mountain View out in Ringgold. It's our area first responders working 24-7 all around the clock, all around the calendar to make sure you stay safe, to make sure I stay safe. So, guys, give yourselves a big round of applause. We appreciate you all very much. And ladies, too, I can't forget that. So what you all do is priceless, and what we're doing here is just a little bit a little bit of the sincere heartfelt thanks that each and every one of you deserve. So um, we know it's not easy doing what you do, especially with the COVID pandemic going on. All of us at News 12 now, all the folks at McKee Bakery, all the folks at WFLI and all the great, great people who helped put this together, we owe you just our immeasurable thanks. And in a lot of cases, our lives, literally. Think about that. They put their lives on the line every day for us. This is the least we can do. We talked about McKee Bakery, McKee Foods, rather, supplying all of these delicious Little Debbie Be My Valentine cakes. And joining us now is Jacqueline Webb. And Jacqueline is the Communications and Public Relations Specialist with McKee. First of all, Jacqueline, welcome. Thank you so much for having me. If you'd been here any other year, it would have been like 70 <laughs> degrees. The sun would have been shining. These guys would have been laughing and joking. But nah, it's not the best of days. But we appreciate you braving the elements. Tell me why you decided to get involved with this. Well, we were contacted because the community was not able to donate products like they had done in the past, and we had the perfect delicious heart-shaped cake, so we checked our inventory, and we were able to supply the product, and, you know, we want nothing more than to give back to the community, especially to our first responders and the nurses and doctors. They work tirelessly every day to protect us and provide for us, and this past year with the COVID-19 pandemic, it's been no different, so we just want to say thank you so much for just everything you do, and we hope this puts a little bit of a smile on your face today. I know what you guys do out at McKee, you're having to be very COVID socially responsibly distant, just like these folks in their departments are, just like you and I are here now. Um, any Anything new on the horizon for McKee that we can expect over the coming weeks? By the way, I love the new Little Debbie cereal. I'm just going to put do? that out there. Yes, I do. yes, yes. We made a big announcement. Um, in December, we have an oatmeal cream pie cereal in partnership with Kellogg. And they're actually partnering with us again. And coming out this spring, it's going to be a cosmic brownie cereal, which we are very, very excited about. But um, I, after these Valentine's cakes get off the shelf this coming week, we actually have spring and Easter products. So we'll be looking for those. They're delicious cakes, brownies, um, and Easter egg cake rolls, and uh, llama brownies. Wow, sounds good. What do y'all think about that? Let's give Jacqueline a big round of applause. Jacqueline, thank you so much on behalf of all of these folks and everyone who helped put this together. It could not be done without your generous donation and the folks from McKee Bakery. Well, thank, we thank you, and you we appreciate much. you guys. Thank you very much. It is going to be a chilly Valentine's weekend, no doubt about it, but it does warm your heart to see what these guys and these ladies are doing along with the folks out of McKee.